Hello everybody, welcome back to another Premiere Pro tutorial. In this one, I'm going to show you how to do the pencil sketch effect. And I'm going to show you how to do it from hard pencils or, you know, the 8Hs or the 6Hs of the world all the way to the big soft B pencils or whatever they're called. So let me show you step by step how I did it. Here's just a couple examples, as you can see here, as I kind of flip through here. I'm going to show you how to do it. Let's go from scratch. It should take about 60 seconds. Let's delete everything from the beginning. Okay, good. First step, drag and drop your footage into the timeline like I've done there. Next, go to your effects panel right here where it's located and grab the black and white effect. Drag and drop it onto your footage like I've done there. Now, we've got this cool black and white effect. It's not where we want to go though, so what we want to do next is we want to go back to the effects panel and type into the search bar, find edges. When you type that in, you'll see video effects, stylized, find edges. Drag and drop that on. Now, it automatically applies at 0% blending and that's not what we want. Although, if you really want the white and uh, white background look, maybe that is what you're going for. You do have the option here to go ahead and increase the blending. So I'm just going to blend it to about, let's go a little over here to about 30%. And you can also invert it, but again, that's not really too useful for you. So this is the basic kind of hard pencil light sketch effect. We can add more and go a little deeper. The next step, and this is optional, of course, you go to effects and you type in the extract effect. Video effects adjust extract. Drag and drop that onto the timeline. And now you're going to see a pretty wicked look. This is not what we're going for. Check this out. We're going to go to the extract, but we're going to go ahead and invert this. So make sure this check box is, or this box is checked. And then presto, we now have a bit of a softer pencil, uh, very high contrast look. You can go in and adjust the blacks and the whites. So you'll see here that depending on this type of style of sketch that you're going for, you can go ahead and make these adjustments. Do that as you see fit. I'm going to just go with this to show you what you need to do. Now, the next step is I'm going to hold down the Alt key on a PC, Option key on a Mac. I'm going to click on my timeline, the video on my timeline, and I'm going to push up. That makes a duplicate copy. Doesn't do anything out of the box, but watch this. If I click on the top video, now I can go in and adjust this from a into the effect controls panel again. Change the blend mode from normal to multiply. And we're going to start now having a few different changes here. So I'm going to go now down and I'm going to make some adjustments to the extract level and the blend level. So I can go ahead now and decrease and increase this. So for example, if I turn that layer off, you know, a little bit lighter. Darker pencil sketches. You can go ahead now and start making these changes. And by doing this and blending them together, you can really dial in the type of pencil sketch effect you're looking for. That's all I got for this one, guys. Thanks for watching. Be back soon.